Okay, I'm actually extremely hyped to jump into this video because I thought that this deck, my Subterra deck, was actually all Dark Monsters. I literally thought this deck was made of nothing but Dark Monsters. Turns out they're Earth, which means I could use them in the Attribute 4 event. So I'm actually going to jump into that event right now with this deck and see how well I can do. Oh, you're going to regret letting me go first. Ooh, this hand, this hand. Okay. Ooh, I didn't, I did not see you in my hands. Subterra Guru. Okay. This hand is it. This hand is it. All right. Place you in defense. And then I fucked up already. I fucked up already. I need to place you face up, not face down. Damn it. Now to a good start. Didn't mean to fuck up like that already, but maybe my opponent won't be able to defeat me in the first turn. Maybe they won't be able to get set up in the first turn. Maybe they bricked. It's, it's not looking like they bricked. You know what? He doesn't realize it, but that actually helped me out. I'll take the 3,000 damage. I'm fine with that. But yeah, no, that actually helped me out. Fuck. All right, that's a good card, but that was not the one I wanted. Actually, hold up. I thought I took this card out of this deck. I guess I didn't. All right. So this time, let's not fuck up. Summon Subterra Guru in attack mode. Use his effect. Put you in the face down defense, him in face down defense. Use his effect. Special summon him onto the field. And then flip you face down as well. And then I end my turn. I don't know why I was surprised by the fact that they're summoning this. This is something that everyone's been using this entire event. Switch it to you. You know what? I'm not mad at I'm not mad. I'm actually fine with that. It changes what I was planning on doing, but not so much that it bothers me. Because now I can do this. And what has a good graveyard effect? Uh, all right, gonna send that to the graveyard. And he can't attack again. Can he? Oh wait, why is he not attacking? Huh. Activate your effect. All right, so my plan is use your effect. I'm going to activate that, banish it, flip him face down so that I can summon you. Summon you. Okay, and then I'm going to end my turn. If I draw Rageki, that'd be great for me right now, but until then, I there's not much I can do because Link Monsters can't go into the fence or face down. Expert her effect. I 
I will summon. Okay, so I'm going to summon you. That way, no matter what, next turn, I have someone that can flash. That's fine. That, you know, that's honestly fine. Wait, you can attack again now? Fuck. I thought you could only do one or the other, not both. Damn it. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they... Yeah, I fucked up. Yeah, fuck, I fucked up. Okay, so sub there, Guru, drawing this card actually is a good thing. Kinda, because now I can activate its effect. Also, flip you face down. And it. Activate his effect. Activate its effect again. Put it face down defense. Ooh, we, we might have something here. Okay, so as long as he doesn't actually read what this thing's effect is, when he attacks it, I can have it banish his Black Luster Soldier, and then I'm actually in a good position to win this again. Fuck me, fuck me. That is the card I was afraid of him summoning. Because now he can take one of my monsters and that is not good. That's not good. He got rid of the card I was afraid of for another copy of Black Luster Soldier. God damn it. Alright, activate his effect. to save me he doesn't realize it but he just why wait, wait 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 he just why didn't my why didn't his effect you can target one opponent why didn't that work I, I i'm so confused if someone could tell me why that didn't work let me know because i don't understand why his effect didn't work all right, well, I, uh, there's not really much I can do. Just put you face down and set this and end my turn. I, I lose next turn. There's nothing I can do right now. Well, that's game. All right, GG's. All right, let's see if Duel 2 is going to be any better. I can't even blame the deck for that. Like, the deck's not bad. I screwed up. There were so many times I fucked up my plan and didn't do the things the way they were supposed to go down. So let's see if I can get a better result this time. Uh, this hand is not great. Yeah, this hand's not great. Okay, uh... Place two cards face down. And hope he doesn't have any back row, back row removal because I'm going to activate Sword of Reveal and Light and buy myself some time.
I just looked over at the time and this actually might end up being the last duel of the video because uh, this game's going on maintenance in about 16 minutes. I'm not even sure I'm going to be able to get through this one. What is this? Okay, that's the first time I'm running into this deck on here. I've literally only been facing the last deck that we just went up against this entire event. And then there was that one person who's using one of the starter decks. Uh, all right, well, this does help me because I did want that to go to the graveyard. So I can get Guru to my hand. There you are. But I'm still not liking the situation I'm in. I mean, 3,000 damage isn't too bad, at least. Okay, that's not the card I wanted. All right, gonna go ahead and summon you, obviously. Metal Reflex Slime. Uh, no, not gonna activate that just yet. But I will, no, no, stop. So what I am gonna do, because now I don't have to be afraid of that face down card, I am going to attack one of his monsters. Heck you. Go to main phase two. Activate your effect. Put you face down. Nope. All right. Activate your effect. You face down. Summon you. And I never actually summoned this card before, so I don't know what it does. You can target one set card on the field equal to the number of. Okay. And then I have my turn. You know what all of these do. You you know why would you? Okay, this guy, this guy is obviously not paying attention to any of the defense. Like, he, did he not realize how strong any of these cards were? Okay, at least he's not. At least he's not dumb enough to try to attack either of the other two. Oh, hello. Okay, so first things first. Get rid of the annoying card. So activate your effect. Choose you. Summon you. Activate you. Get rid of this. Flip you back up. Flip you back up. Activate your effect. And then I am going to link summon these two. Okay. 
Okay. Ooh, so many things I can activate. So many things I can activate right now. What is that anyway? Uh. No, I'm not gonna activate anything. I want to see what he's doing. I want to see what his play is. Hmm. I'm gonna go ahead and activate your effect. Alright, so I'm gonna summon you. I'm gonna flip you face up. Activate your effect. This game. Yep, use your effect. So banish that. And then back with you. Uh sure, why not? Okay, and then attack for game. Oh man, I only played this deck a few times online, so I forgot how much fun it was. Anyway, that is it for this video because the maintenance is going to be starting in like three minutes, so I need to end the video now. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please drop me a like, subscribe to the channel, and come back for more Yu-Gi-Oh! content and other videos. That is it for this one. Catch y'all later.